Hey YouTubers, new on those coins. I have a Jefferson nickel to show you. It's kind of special. And I thought it was worth doing a video on. Alright. What I have here is a 1942 Philadelphia Proof 64 Type 2 Jefferson nickel. It's a mouthful. This is a older PCGS holder from the late 80s, early 90s. Now, what makes this coin special? If you did not know this, I have another video uh, a couple years back of me doing a Jefferson nickel set that was silver. From mid-year 1942 to 45, your Jefferson nickels for circulation were silver. They were 35% silver. Uh, so, in 42, you could get one year only, this one year, you could get a silver proof Jefferson nickel this is the only year only one I say only one they uh, only minted 27,000 and some change uh, Jefferson nickels in 42 now when you get you could only get these in proof sets uh, when you order your proof set, you actually got, since it was mid-year, you actually got a type 1 and a type 2 proof Jefferson Nickel in the mint set. So you got two of each. Back then, your, mint, your proof sets were doubled for some reason. You got two of each coin. So you actually got two of these and two uh, clad proofs which would have been the non-silver type one coin so out of all jefferson nickels out of all the silver ones you only had one that was silver proof and this is it 1942p now let's look at the coin and I want y'all's opinion on something. It's kind of hard to tell because this case has got scratches. You could look at the reflection. It's scratched all up. Now, does that not look cameo to you? What I mean by cameo, if you're not a coin guy or coin girl, the fields are reflective and this is not. This is frosty looking here. The devices... This is called the devices, and the background is called the fields. To me, this coin looks cameoed, and it, it makes a big difference on the price. Even, I'm going a little closer here. Even on the letters, it is not... Reflective, like it's cameoed a little bit. And it's a different color, too. It's toned a little bit. This case has been around the block. I'm going to flip it over to the front. And you can really see it there where the fields are reflective in the devices or his head and neck collar is all kind of a matte color, a matte silver. I don't have another coin right off hand to show you what I'm talking about, but <clears throat> I'm pretty sure you know what I'm talking about. Do I have anything laying out of here? No, I do not. But anyway, <clears throat> that's the uh, That's the only reason I'm considering uh, bringing this one back to PCGS and let them upgrade it. Uh, 
I don't know if they designated. Uh, <clears throat> excuse me. I didn't know. I don't know if they designated cameo or deep cameo back when these holders were made. Um, the reason I'm wanting the cameo there is because in this grade, this coin is about a hundred and twenty-five dollars, like it is. Uh, the cameo part of it plays a big deal in the price. If I was to send this coin back in, and if it come back with cameo right here, or can, it would say C-A-M, um, it would be $900 coin, 950 to be exact. That's in the gray sheet too. Oh, hang on a minute. Let me see what retail it would be. Oh, I don't know if this book shows retail. Hang on one second, guys. I should have all my ducks in a row before I make this video. No, it does not. Yep, it don't. Uh, well, hang on, that's not. One second. One second. I was in the wrong spot. No, it don't. It don't show the cameo on the gray sheet. Let me look at this other book real quick. I'm sorry for the delay. No, it does not. But anyway, on my PCGS price guide, it said it was a difference of $135 on this grade and $950 retail on the Cameo. What do y'all think? You think it's Cameo? I think it is. I think the toning, see it's got some weird toning going on too. I think the toning and everything is covering some of that up. Anyway, if you like this kind of stuff, please let me know. Maybe next time I'll have all my prices written down where I can make a better video but anyway please like share subscribe if you want to see stuff like this let me know in the comments and let me know what you think you think that thing i know the front yeah i think it's got to be cameoed i just don't know if there's enough of it there for them to call it cameoed anyway see you next time